Okay. We're here again. This is Jack. This is Servient, reluctantly. This is Argadi. Not so. And what the fuck is this? Well, when I did recording, I, this guy busted in, held a gun in my head, and told me to do it this way, so I'm doing it this way. Sigh. Yeah? Yeah? Sigh. You know how dangerous it is when soldiers get their own ideas, Comrade Jack. <laughs> yes, I know how dangerous it is. <laughs> I also know that you are not prepared at all. You're, you're never prepared for these shenanigans. Sigh. So sitting through the opening, you know... Credit. Credit things. things. Credit screens. Raven Entertainment. Haven't heard from them in a while. Yeah? What yeah. other works have they made? Uh, did you like the Jedi Knight series? No, um... You mean, um... Oh, yeah, I think I know which one you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that was Raven. Yeah. Okay, um, I didn't actually get a chance to play those, but... What? I did not get a chance to play those. You have a problem I with that, Argadi? I have plenty of problem with that. Alright, so this is about probably the only part of the video I'm gonna guess that's gonna look normal. A except for the stuff on the top and the side. So welcome to Deadpool Ultimate Alliance. Um, this is going to be a solo run-through of Marvel Ultimate Alliance using only Deadpool. At his request, I'm sure. At, at whose request? His. What? You said he held a gun to your head. Oh yeah, yeah. At at the strange gunman's request. Sorry. You also told me to wait this long and play his theme. Yeah. That makes sense. Uh, Otto is not showing up in here, but I, I guess they do have to have fucking Wolverine. Oh, Wolverine has to be in everything Marvel. Like, he was even in the Deadpool game. Yeah. Although you have to smack him around like the little bitch he is. Yeah. Really? He told me he just wanted everyone to see the story, so... Oh my god. What the hell is going on? Where's our air support? Fail. Get those forward guns going. Why aren't those rear Shut up, old guy. Dude. It's Nick Fury, dude. That's not Samuel L. Jackson. Before the Ultimate Reboot. But this is called Ultimate Alliance. Not on my watch. Eh, at least he's still wearing an eye patch. Thor, take care of those gunships. Spider-Man, draw them towards the stern. Sure thing. I just love being a target. Fucking Spider-Man. So... I don't take orders from you. So you fucking Wolverine. Yeah. I'm gonna do the only thing I know how to do. And that's swing it shit. Yeah. And be a badass while doing it. Oh, only because he can regenerate. Yep. Yeah, don't worry about it. These cockbags won't be a thing in about three minutes. Good. Cause. Uh, excuse me. Is this the ferry to Staten Island? Who, who cares about these jokers? These aren't the comedians I was looking for. I mean, seriously, Spider-Man died from a bullet. A bullet. Yeah. Uh -oh. w wasn't he also shittily cloned a bunch of times? Yeah. And no one gave a shit. And now I think he's a gay, half black, half Latino kid. Yeah. Hmm. Could use some help. <laughs> that dude scares me. Why? He's just an alcoholic. Yeah, seriously. I noticed that Serviet's being awfully quiet. Sigh. <laughs> Thor, I got no beef with Thor. Girls looking at? Gentlemen, this is Colonel Nick Fury. I'm on the main bridge, but I'm not sure how long I'll last. Get here ASAP. Fury out. 
Anyway, let's get these fuckers, shall we? Alright. And here is... <laughs> Strike one against us. I don't know, I thought, I thought I didn't tell me to do this, it was pretty funny. I thought it was funny. Here is Jack yeah. taking creative liberties that will cost him dearly. <laughs> yep. Um, to be fair, I mean, like, this is the de facto sped up anything <laughs> music. <laughs> Shut up and get moving move music. Yep. Especially when it's a bunch of people you don't care about throwing around shields like an idiot. You know, for Deadpool Ultimate Alliance, you think they would have cut this part of the game? Eh. Uh, comedy value. Yeah, pl plus, some people might know, not know about the first, like, 15 hours or whatever on the helicarrier. Couple of minutes. Yeah. Feels like 15 hours until you can get, you know, actual good people in your party. Yeah. Seems like it sometimes. Yep. Thanks for responding to my SOS so quickly. The helicarrier is under attack by a group of supervillains called the Masters of Evil. And to make matters worse, they're led by Victor Von Doom. My thoughts exactly. Who the hell names the group the Masters of Evil? It's not important. Yeah, because if you're in the okay. Masters of Evil, then how can you be led by your own master? I told you. He would be the Grand Master. Fair enough, Nick. Well, them being led by Doom makes sense later in the game. Yeah. Considering what happens, I don't know if you guys know what happens later in the game or not. It, it's been a long time since I played. Yeah. And now we get rid of all these useless Good. cum rags, and we put in the only character that matters. Iron Man, right? Deadpool. Oh, fair enough. Somebody take a picture. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You better have a uh, da damn good taste of music, that's all I'm saying. I think he does. <laughs> Such a <laughs> blasphemy. You will pay dearly for your crimes. This is only part one, remember that. Yeah. There's three parts so far. <laughs> so he told me to, to, to when he came out to replace it with a Strider Heroes theme from Marvel vs. Capcom. That yeah, works. Now I went in and turned off the two options there. One of the options, when you find a new piece of equipment, it'll auto-equip it for you to give you the best gear, but if you're trying to go for a certain build, that's not very useful. Yeah. And it also by default automatically spends any skill points you collect. Yeah, screw that. So I turn I turned those both off. And doing whatever it is Wolverine does. It, it's true. So I don't think that Wolverine can teleport. Yeah, so that makes it better than Wolverine anyway. Yeah. Also Wolverine only uses claws. What, what the fuck, bro? Well, He uses more than his claws. Name me one combat situation that Wolverine didn't solve with his claws. His feet, his fist, his head. All of those are attachments of his claws, sir. No. Face it, Wolverine's a one-trick pony. No, two tricks. He can regenerate, and he can claw bitches. And he has an adamantium skeleton, which means that while he's also durable, 
Yeah, all that's, of his, that's part of his claws. Well, it's attached to his claws, yes, but... Yes, and therefore it's part of his claws. How is kicking somebody in the head attached to his claws? When have you ever seen him kick someone in the head? He usually stabs them in the head. He's, yes, he does make frivolous use of his claws, but that's all he needs. That's all anybody needs. Nothing better than claws would be like eye laser claws, where instead of a laser, it's it's a, a beam of claws, an endless stream of. And and, and then face. we get into horrible monstrosities that should never be brought up, especially in the presence of a madman. Pretty much. So this is just basically me going around and beating down robots. Yeah. Ultron sen Sentinels or whatever. Ultron Sentinels. Yeah. And Warriors. And me getting reacquainted with his power sets. His power sets are a little wonky compared to other heroes. I mean, they're, they're fun to mess with, but they're still wonky. Yeah. Like the sword move that I have, uh, the, the, his basic attack. Um, when you use it, it moves you two steps forward, which means if you miss your target, you fucking miss your target. <laughs> yeah. And there you found the teleport button. Well, no, I was trying to use it before, but that guy was in the way, and uh, finally he moved where I could, you know, pull it off. Uh, so Deadpool didn't just uh, find that his teleporter wasn't broken in this, uh, this issue? No, this is a totally player fail. Okay. The only way to stop those missiles from firing is to destroy the consoles that control them. I I'm sure Deadpool would have a much uh, better way to take him out than that, but whatever. It it's restricted to the game developers. Stuff. Yeah. This is before he. Uh, Point again to their heads to tell them how to make the game. Pretty much. <laughs> still need to play that game. Yeah, you do. I still need to finish it myself. <sighs> you didn't even try and look up porn on it. This is not the Deadpool I'm used to. <laughs> this is a kid-friendly Deadpool. Eh, I guess. He was a lot more himself in Deadpool Legends 2 Rise of Apocalypse. Ah, oh, yes. Which, uh... I understand might be a thing that you do also. Right after this, yeah. That's, um, I already have the game ready to go. Hey, Excellent. I won. I won. But I figured one project at a time. Yep. As opposed to the massive projects we have going right now. <laughs> yeah. I like to be a little focused. Sure. Whatever you say, well, Captain. Let's spend two hours wandering around a fucking force. I, I've read myself in my inability to complete levels. <laughs> For those of you getting tired of the Strider music, which I'm not personally, but it's about to change. Excellent. Not because I'm getting tired of it, but you like to see what choices he gave me, to eat, what he told me to use. Exactly. Well, 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 aren't you just an impressive bunch of heroes? Too bad, my good buddy. So do you? Do you pull out the? Or did he have you pull out the meat suit for this? You wouldn't be trying to. The meat suit? Missile, you didn't launched. you didn't ever see that or read that uh hey, comic? If the boss wants me to launch a missile uh, the heavily I'll have to uh, show it to you later. I'll okay. Do it. I don't get paid that it, it was quite possibly Sorry, the best fight I ever can't. of all time. <laughs> and even if I did step aside, there's nothing you could do. I've got the only access card to the navigation computer. I got a funny feeling I that these uh dialogue choices are not uh, hero specific. No, they're not. Now there are certain characters that you run into that if a character would know them, they do voice them. But most of the time, no, they're just generic. 
Yeah. The, the hero-specific choices and dialogue were in Ultimate Alliance 2. Which is not on PC and therefore much harder to record, record yeah. for us at the moment. Wish they would have made a PC release. So, uh, come on, Bullseye, where's your... And now I'm better at doing whatever it is Wolverine does. Our guy, he approved of the choice of music. Yep. He wondered why... He probably wondered why I asked him that the other day. <laughs> no, I was sure it'd be something like this. <laughs> and Serbian's over here, his head in his hands going, Ugh. I hate you all, etc., etc. Pretty much. <laughs> well done. Just wait till we get to the final boss of this area. Bullseye was there. You must really be serious about recruiting talent. Come no fury. I don't know, he went down pretty easy. Wouldn't exactly call that talent. Well, he wasn't, you know, out of range and trying to, you know, snipe Deadpool between the eyes. Like he normally does. Yeah. Not that it would have worked to begin with, but... Uh, he actually does pull some pretty crazy shit in his fight that I was talking about earlier. Oh, oh, it was dead. It was Bullseye versus Deadpool. Yeah, okay. and uh, Bullseye at the time was impersonating Hawkeye. Okay. You'll have to show me that. Yes. I also edited out all the loading screens. Good man. Black Widow, I specifically ordered you not to engage the enemy. I am sorry, sir. It was unable. Anyone who's played Mega Man actually recognizes well. music. Please just say, Team, you have to stop the enemy from destroying the engine. If they're successful, the helicarrier is finished. So, uh, do you use any of Deadpool's other costumes in this, or not really? Um, in the second, in, yeah, in half of the second to the third video, I switched to his, what they call his ultimate costume. Yeah? Uh, because I had a specific build in mind. Mm. And then I did some research on some of the abilities like he has and their mana costs, and then I switched back to this one. Yeah. I thought so, this uh, was, uh... There are certain areas in the game where you have to have more than one person in order to progress, there's no getting around that. I do not take them into a combat situation, though. I only take them to solve the puzzle. Then you'll see after this, I go right back and I get rid of them. Yeah. Okay. But th there was there was there was no hack or anything to get around this. We are I am playing the PC version, by yeah. the way. Um, do you always take uh, the smoke out babes in the Marvel universe? No, I just I just pick whoever grabs my. Eye. Okay. So the smoking out babes, in the Marvel universe. Got it. Maybe in two, because you can't do this in two. Mm. Whatever happens, remember to protect you. What, go solo? Yeah. No, they pretty much force a party on you. That's a damn shame. Thanks for setting so it what you say it is a party of four, kind of, of one players. Deadpool and his three clone buddies. Gotcha. So, uh, Deadpool, Actually, no. Agent X, um... Electra. Electra? Well, I don't think Agent X was even in Ultimate Alliance 2. No. That shield agent looks suspiciously like Gambit. He does. I promise I will not be going through any, except for the next video, I won't be going through any of the side things. Um, I tried to add more depth to it, but like I said, the guy who told me to do this is ADD kicked in and just... Yeah. Which is why I also won't be doing a lot of the hub area side quests, except for grabbing some things. Excellent. This will be a very streamlined LP. Sure. No, it, it is. Straightforward and to the point. I like it. Like, if there are side quests in the main combat area, I'll do them. But that's normally because for each level, there's only, like, one or maybe, maybe two side quests. Yeah. And you do get something for doing them. It's not gear, but it helps your character's power up. And we'll see that in the third video. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, you no know, one wants to fuck with Wolverine. Yeah. He, he's a short, smelly alcoholic with uh, claws. Except for Deadpool. Deadpool fucks with Wolverine all the time. Well, that that's because he can take it. He can take the punishment. Yeah. And it's hilarious. And it is hilarious. Like, I don't think Wolverine can do it, but Deadpool can come back from, like, being blown to bits. Uh... Yeah, he's definitely stronger than, uh, Wolverine's, um... Wolverine, though, has come back from a nuke, apparently, so... Really? that, yeah. Like, well, then Deadpool could probably do it. Yeah. And with more style. Exactly. I don't know. I think they're about to bar. Depend it's very situational. Well, I mean, they, they both have limiting factors, like Deadpool's healing factor is mostly holding back his cancer. And uh, Wolverine's is, is being poisoned by a skeleton. Well, it's not even just poison, it's... Uh... No, it, it is explicitly poison. Or toxicity or something. Well, it's effect. also heal con like his his skeleton's constantly ravaging his body, but his regeneration no, is trust. keeping it together. That's the whole point. The reason why they gave him the regeneration in the you first place. Yeah. They, they tried to incorporate the design because he was his design from the ground up as a super soldier. And they pro in their prototypes, I'm You're in for a world of surprise, fairly sure that they would have tried with just the skeleton and then found that the damage it caused to the body was too high, so they tried to handle. find a way to keep yes. equilibrium, and that's where the regeneration enemies. came into play. Yeah. Good. So, but lava does the same I effect on both, so. Yeah. So I forget. Which soldier is a brainwashed? Captain Gwender Soldier was Captain America's partner in World War II. Yeah, who, who died. And was brought back by the Soviets. By the Soviets. Yes. Yeah. Glorious. I have no clue who the fuck a radioactive man is. Uh, I'm sure some douchebag who goes down like a punk. Oh no, that's not going down like a punk. I'll show you going down by a punk later in the video. Sorry. Okay. We got a little carried away, but we're on it. Lower the force fields and let's clear out of here. It is lucky for you we must depart. I was just getting warm up. But we will meet again. That is one I thing that I've always enjoyed with the Raven Marvel games, like X-Men Legends, X-Men Legends 2, Marvel Ultimate Alliance, and Ultimate Alliance 2 to some extent. It's not just going around beating up mooks. There are a lot of boss fights strewn throughout the levels that make yeah. it fun. A lot of uh, shoutouts to B and C to uh, C tier list villains as well as the A list. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I like the won. freaking D list tier that was in uh, Deadpool. Yeah. Yeah, that was totally D list. With, with the exception of Mr. Sinister or whatever the fuck his name is. That guy is a list, and from what I what I understand, he still went down like a bitch. Uh, again, I haven't played all the way through, but from what I understand, his boss fight is frustrating towards the end. My brother said the same thing. Yeah. Of course, honestly, between you and the fence posts, I, th I think it's because they weren't playing on the master race. True. Because it. It is so much easier to aim with mouse and keyboard in that game. The only reason I'm not using mouse and keyboard with this is simply because when I when I played it when I first beat it, it was with the 360 controller. Yeah, well, uh, I think it was the Xbox S controller at yeah. that time. Yeah. No, I beat it on 360 the first time, but I had played it multiple times before on like PS2 and Xbox. And oh, okay. PSP. I told you they follow. They're as predictable as the sunrise. Come then, hero. That is not something you say about oh, Deadpool. <laughs> <laughs> that is not something Deadpool would say either. No, it's no, not. Uh, I, I think he would do it for the quote value. Plus, maybe he's trying to be a good guy. Yeah. This is when he was on that end of his uh, manic depression. Yeah. Attack! 
Oh no, more robots. Whatever shall I do? Punch them in the face. Repeatedly. Yep. Oh no, they're resistant to energy. What I picked up there was there, those little pickups uh, scattered throughout the game. Uh, they add one. You have three core stats in this game. You have a uh, focus, body, and striking. Right. Right. Uh, body is your health. Focus is your mana, and striking is your physical damage. Yeah. You pick one of those up, and they give you a plus one permanent boost to set stat. Nice. Now this game was designed with a party of four in mind, so those things are, sh are scattered all over the place. But since we're going solo, and Jeez. those. Yeah, I think by the end I'm going to be pretty beefy. And I'm going to and and considering the last two major boss fights in the game, <laughs> I'm going to need every pickup I can get. You yep. are officially a leader. And when we get there, you'll see why. <laughs> if you haven't already beaten the game, that is, in which case you know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> You just keep keep running away, uh whoever the hell your name is. He's a disgrace to nuclear based superhero super villains and superheroes everywhere. Yeah. Come on, he couldn't even get the name like Fusion Man or Fission Man or something. Or Red Star. Or Cat Madam. Yeah. I guess it's better than Radioactive Skull or whatever the fuck his name is. Yeah, <laughs> that was pretty bad. Well, I'll give Jack this much. He's been making a good run of it so far. Yep. Now, I myself haven't played Ultimate Alliance for an extended period, but I did play with an old... Uh, friend of mine a while back, so... So notice I picked up that pipe. Yep. There's we're, a reason I picked it up. We were well aware that you picked up the pipe. You are too late. In a matter of moments, the Winter Soldier will have unlocked the security code for this gun. Then, we shall fire it into the engine. Oh no! Whatever understand? shall we do? You can't defeat the Masters of Evil. We're just too powerful. Abandon ship while you still can. Deadpool be asking why the fuck he wasn't invited. Oh wait, no, he's trying to be a hero this time. Never mind. Yeah. Quiet, Chan. You've already said too much. Ah, it does not matter. They will not live to tell anyone. Why don't we make sure of that? No. That's why I brought the pipe. Uh, because uh, Bucky is weak to uh, pipes. As is Chan. <laughs> Everyone is weak to pipes. Pipes, what they do when you pick them up and you attack with it, it gives you a massive boost to your core damage. Huh. And since I'm on easy, and yeah. I have a pipe... Alright, so, note to self, I get stuck in the Marvel Universe, always carry around a lead pipe. Yeah. Got it. Unless you're fighting a supervillain that has uh, certain powers against the metal. No, uh, even against him. Yeah. The only one I wouldn't want to is a Squirrel Girl. That's just because she'd find a way around that weakness anyway. And just totally destroy you and the rest of the universe. Yeah. Too OP. Too strong. And against Deadpool. I don't think a metal pipe would work too well against him. Might work for a couple of minutes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm amazed I got up there as easy as it did. Normally you have to have a flying character to get up there, but you can glitch and get up there. Yeah. Man. Nothing somewhere on the other side? No. I, I, once again, when I played through this for this LP versus, I didn't remember exactly where all the tokens were at. So if I go off exploring or something, bear with me. <laughs> okay. That's alright. We know you'll fast forward through those bits. Uh. Well, you already fast forwarded through the other boring bits, right? Right? <laughs> Yeah. Sure. Fast 40 is definitely a thing that happens during all backtracking and other nonsense that happens on here. As you can quite clearly tell. Well, there really isn't a lot of backtracking in this game. Yeah. Yeah. 
Some huge creature, huh? Some huge creature. It like some winged beast or something. I'm not entirely sure what you would call something like that. Why is Angel attacking the ship? He's fucking useless. All I can do is like fly on his wings. <laughs> I don't know. Seriously though, what 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 is that guy's steal? And why did he get to be one of the four horsemen? I don't know. He seems to pick those a complete random. I guess. So now there's Doombots, as well as Ultrons. Yep. <sighs> statues, statues, Shit. and more statues are getting... Yes, I, I know. The Servient is uh, looking very excited at all this. No, these are poor excuses for statues. Because they're going down so easily to his awesomeness. Wait until video 4. No, even then. No, wait, yeah, yeah, video 4. You'll, you'll like what you see, Servian. Does, uh, AIM get into the robotics business in this game, or not really? AIM? Yeah. Con no, no, you, you, no? you settle with AIM in the next video. Okay. AIM gets handled pretty damn quick. <laughs> mm. I say, I like that they, uh, had them featured in, uh, Iron Man 3. But Fuck I don't Iron think Man that's 3. huh. Fuck Iron Man three. Fuck you. Anyway, you were saying. Uh, I don't think it was anything like how AIM would be, except for maybe being behind a extremist. No, it wasn't anything like AIM would be. Yeah. But again, that's what uh, Iron Man three was all about. Destroying known characters. Yep. And that's why I loved it so much. Moving on. <laughs> We're coming up to the f to the final boss of this level. Excellent. OMG spoilers. Yeah, yeah. We You want some more spoilers? The final boss is Doctor Doom. Really? You Bastards! How could you? I, is there a super boss that's Galactus? Galactus is in the game, yes. He is? Is he a secret boss that you can fight? No. Oh. Um, you that's, actually that's try to steal something from him. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Keyword there, try. I'm not gonna say one way or the other. We could have been friends. Freaking Ultron and Doombots. Yeah, totally useless. Got to, got to wreck all the stuff. Collect the uh, as coins. many coins as I feel like collecting. Yeah. Now, I like the song he had me play for this boss fight. Yep. Not especially. Uh, Servient. Oh, wait, no, you can hear it. See, I did a preemptive side before it started playing. Because I knew it was coming. <laughs> yep. Do you? Yeah. See so yeah, how we were talking about it earlier? Yeah. I thought it was funny. It makes sense. So I'm guessing that there if was. If you were bashing his skull in right now. Then uh, it would fit, but he's still like even if you're kicking his ass, he still remains his posture, so it loses its uh, effect a little bit there. But he is a magic dragon. 
He is a magic dragon. Like, that's his whole thing. Most dragons are magical to some capacity, though. So. Yeah, but he's like even more so. I'm also guessing. So, so you, you might say he'd be a dragon wizard, Jimmy, or, or better yet, a dragon sorcerer. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's epic level both. He doesn't. He's, if he's epic level, he's not showing it right now. True. He, the obviously was replaced by a doom bot. Obviously. Everything was replaced by a doom yeah, bot. Yeah, that 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 actually is the uh, secret. I I'm sorry I let that get spoiled ahead of time, but everything in Marvel Ultimate Alliance was replaced by doom bots. <sighs> if and you say so. I do. I mean. How else are they going down so easily to lead pipes? Also, why didn't you pick up a lead pipe before you came in here? There wasn't any around. Oh. Sure. I see a pipe right there in the corner. You should have grabbed it. Why? He's dead. True. It took you long enough. That wasn't the most graceful battle I've ever seen, but you saved the helicarrier. Ouch. There's only one person on the team. What the hell? Come back to the bridge, you'll find out. Yeah, you gotta read up the last few warriors. Yeah, just that that's my O C D C kicking in. Yep. Yep, O C D alright. Who are these faggots? Oh wait, those guys. Why is he always late? Hello team, welcome to Stark Tower, my pride and joy. It's 40 stories of heaven on earth. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with just a few billion dollars. We are now a team? Yes. I've been empowered by S.H.I.E.L.D. to create a task force to stop the Masters of Evil. But the helicarrier was so badly damaged that it can't be used as a headquarters. Fortunately, Tony is willing to let us stay here for the duration. It has all the facilities we'll require. Believe me, it's no problem at all. And I called in a few old friends to help us out. Feel free to walk around and meet them. I'd suggest you meet Hank Pym first, since he's in charge of equipment. The Vision is here as our information officer. Great. We got a computer to talk to the computer. We'll be talking with none of these people. When you're ready to go Excellent. on a mission, talk to Wyatt Wingfoot. He'll take you there in one of my Quinjets. Speaking of that, I, I really don't want to talk to Hank Pym. I recently received a radio transmission from Dum Dum Dugan requesting that I come to the Omega base. But there was something questionable in his message. You think it might be a trap? Maybe. Maybe. I can't be sure. For more information, talk to the Black Widow. Is that another thing we're not going to be doing? No, we do talk to her because she gives us basic mission info. Okay. And that's the end of episode one of the LP. Tune in next time. Thanks, Tony.